record in just one day. The United States saw more new coronavirus cases than in the first two months of the pandemic. Are you at all concerned about the coronavirus? No, not really. I mean, uh, obviously it's a serious, serious thing, and, and it, it, but it's like a bad flu. I mean, I was very surprised how many people die annually from the flu. In the middle of the month, I packed up all my things. My dad picked me up, and we left the city. Though I may be safer, though it may have been right, not being on the front lines keeps me up at night. How are we gonna go back today? I don't. I haven't even thought. I haven't like. I don't even know. I don't even know. I mean, is it gonna be because I am definitely inappropriately texting with someone that I shouldn't be texting with? I think part of the reason I'm flirting with him and texting with him is that there is no chance that we can see each other. I'm being so reckless because I, right. you know, I know right. this can't go anywhere. One day randomly, an ex reached out to me. She said I'm sorry for everything she ever said or did to me. Now that I'm alone and living in my phone. but it's an opportunity. It really is something you got to look at. Like you said something to me when I, I asked you last week how you're doing. You said you're just, you're just trying to uh, accept. And I think that's the key. If you can accept it, then you can be proactive about it. You can be creative about it. You can just take whatever life force you have and, and you know, look at what, what, what are the possibilities here. 